How's it going everyone? Welcome back to Forza Horizon 5. It's week 51 of 2022 and as usual we've got a bunch of Forza related news, new stuff, potential expansion release date in fact in this video, the Golden Tank Awards which we can actually have a chance of winning, leaked stuff, just your usual weekly update video. So if you do enjoy this video and you don't want to miss another one make sure to subscribe, we do these stuff on a weekly basis. Let's jump into it then, shall we? So first, I'm just going to quickly talk about all of the Forza support news lately, all of the things they're sort of tweeting out. On December the 14th, they identified an issue in Horizon 5 where Japanese language players were having sort of issues with the incorrect header text. If you've been having that issue, it is now identified. On December the 16th, they reminded people that NVIDIA GPU users are having crashing issues and they have released the fix for this, but you have to go and download and install the latest stuff you can see on screen. They actually tweeted about it almost a month ago now. And it seems like lots of people are still having crashing issues, but are not, they don't know that Forza are basically telling you how to fix it. So if you're having GPU issues, crashing issues with NVIDIA GPUs, this is how to sort it out. It does say here, make sure to get on that. And on December the 21st, they identified some issues with vehicle models, not a very serious one, but it's worth noting. So that's everything on the Forza support side. Now we have a new announcement from Playground Games about the Golden Tank Awards. Let me roll a quick video for you guys. Hello everyone, Charlie here with a very special announcement for our Event Lab creator community. I am so pleased to announce da -da -da, the first ever Golden Tank Awards are coming early next year where we'll be celebrating the very best Event Lab creations from our community across five distinct categories. The nominations are now open via the address you can see right here on screen, so get to voting. The most popular picks for each category will make it into a shortlist with the winners selected by our expert panel of judges and revealed on a future live stream. You can promote your own events or share who you think should win using the hashtag Golden Tank Awards. Good luck, everybody. Golden Tank Awards early next year. Now that sounds very cool. I can imagine that will get a lot of people keen on joining the world of Event Lab Creations. I don't really do many myself and it might, it might make me give it a go, see if we can if we can get up there. I'll leave the graphic on screen for a second. If you want to have a chance of winning some of these Golden Tank Awards and be voted for, um, get on Event Lab and start creating. It's pretty cool that they're doing stuff like this that's, that really gets players keen on using these new features and being creative with maps and stuff like that. So Golden Tank Awards sound pretty cool. I'm sure we will hear more of that in the future in their live streams as they mentioned. Another announcement, or not really announcement, on the Forza Horizon Twitter. Again, you'll be surprised how much stuff Forza are playing around games put on Twitter that everybody should really know. So over on Forza Horizon, they noted that last week on the 15th of December, we hit the first reward of Secret Santa, and they said that 4.5 million cars were ha had to be gifted to reach that point, which means that I can presume that to get the final reward that we know is a Lamborghini Sion, 10 million cars have to be gifted. It's quite cool to know the exact number. 10 million cars we have to gift between us. Um, I think this is about where the bar is now. It's probably a little bit further. This was taken a couple of days ago. So we're getting there. We're sort of almost at the Lamborghini Sea and it's almost going to arrive before Christmas, maybe. Maybe just after Christmas, I'm not sure. What else have we got? Well, we have sort of another leaked car. Um, over on the Instagram of Forza Horizon Official, this um, image was spotted. A bunch of Koenigseggs, and you can actually spot in the screenshot a Koenigsegg CCX. Now, a Koenigsegg CCX is not in Horizon 5. However, what's actually quite interesting about this is they actually deleted this post and then re-uploaded it without the CCX in the photo. We can see it's on the right-hand side here, and then boom. They repost it and it's gone and you can see everybody in the comments notice this so this is for one of two reasons one the CCX isn't coming and they don't want to give us false hope so they got rid of it and reposted it and they, they completely forgot that it was in there to begin with or two they are planning on releasing it but they don't want to tell us just yet I mean it's already too late but it could be coming and they're like oh we weren't supposed to show that yet it's coming in a few updates. It's probably not that. It's probably more so that the CCX isn't coming 
So even though it has been leaked twice now, and it's on the leaked car list, as you can see on screen, it was actually leaked in the Hot Wheels trailer a few months ago. Now it's been leaked again, but this time they've removed it. So I don't know what to take of this. It's still on the leaked car list. We're going to leave it on there anyway, but I thought it was pretty funny that they later deleted this. Now, the second thing to talk about is one of my favorites, and it is all about, bear with me, the second expansion release time or announcement time. Now, expansions usually don't get announced sort of randomly by Playroom Games. They are usually often, oh, I nearly said oftenly then, more often than not announced within an Xbox Games Showcase livestream event. Now, there has been some talk about there being an Xbox Games Showcase event very early next year. Now, what else has been announced for very early next year? The second expansion. Torben himself has said that expansion 2 is coming in early 2023. We're also hard at work building the second expansion for Forza Horizon 5, and you can expect to see it in early 2023. We will have more to share after we enter the new year. And we have also had hints about Series 17, which is early 2023, being a big update. I'll show that again on screen now. This was sort of a teaser they put in a live stream a few weeks back. Does everyone want to join me in saying adios? Yes. Adios. 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 Go. We're up, well, guys. Come okay. On. There we go. That was a good one. For series 14, 15, 16, that's nailed, right? Any information about series 17, by any chance? Oh, it's going to be so good. The theme is so good. Me and Chris been messing around. We still on. Oh. Oh. What? So obviously, series 17 going to be a big deal they're kind of hinting towards it series 17 is in february i think that is early 2023 so everything adds up to early 2023 and this xbox games showcase will be a perfect place to announce and show off this second expansion for it then to release in series 17 or maybe 18. If you google xbox showcase early 2023 you'll see a bunch of articles that are speculating that there's been lots of rumors about it there's been lots of talk from reliable sources that Xbox are doing a showcase in early 2023. January, February time, I'm hearing January mainly. This is just one of the places, one of the podcasts that this was mentioned from trusted sources. You know, they aren't 100% accurate, but they are people that you can, you know, you can trust it. You can believe that it might actually be happening. Let's talk about this Xbox showcase early next year. So, it sounds like Xbox has something planned for early next year. Now, there was the Aaron Greenberg tweet. You got Aaron saying what he said, not n not too long to see new stuff. We know they have games coming. You have Tao Common saying, hey, I was recently at the completed Xbox studio. You see the picture of like the logo, and you're like, all right, well, something's going on. You heard rumors that... Uh... I just want to say, by the way, it's really funny that he tweeted that out and deleted it and expected no one to pick yeah, the it up. Internet, <laughs> the internet remembers. The internet always yes. remembers. So, you know, you, you put it out there that you were hearing unverifiable, unverifiable rumors. Or unverifiable. Un, un, unverifiable, man. I can't speak. I actually was hit up by a couple people I know that told me that they're hearing Xbox is putting planning or putting on something. I have like two different people. Uh, that said that they're putting on a show or something's happening in early early 2023. So so that sounds very cool. If we do get an Xbox game showcase, January, February time, not exactly sure what early 2023 means. I bet that there's a very high chance that that stream, that showcase will have the Horizon 5 second expansion in it. I'd say if these rumors about an Xbox showcase are true, there's a very good chance we can hear about both Horizon 5 Expansion 2 and Forza Motorsports 2023, whatever you want to call it. As for what the second expansion is going to be, for the first time in a while, I don't think we actually have any idea. With Horizon 4, it was leaked that it was going to be Lego and it was confirmed when it was announced. We sort of knew in advance that this was going to be Hot Wheels and it was confirmed and announced. In this case, for the second expansion, we really have no idea. Only thing that we can safely presume about the second expansion is that there will be a new feature within it that they are testing for Horizon 5. For every Forza Horizon release, there's usually something within one of the expansions that they're testing for the next game. 
They were testing trailblazers back on Fortune Island, I think. They were testing snow back on Blizzard Mountain. Um, you know, they were always testing something within the expansions. So expansion two will probably have something within it that they're sort of testing. There's a very good chance that the waterfalls and the water effects within Hot Wheels expansion number two are testing for Horizon 5. So maybe Horizon 5 will have some kind of waterfall area within the map. We're not sure. But that's pretty much everything for this video, guys. If you missed last week's episode, make sure to go check that. We've talked about even more leaked stuff, a leaked Horizon story, another leaked car, a bunch of stuff as usual. Um, and if you want to see next video, make sure to subscribe so you don't miss it. Give a like if you've enjoyed, subscribe if you haven't already for more content just like this. And I'll see you all later.